What's up my Mitch Mage? Welcome back to the channel for yet another video. Today's a little bit of a different topic than what we normally talk about as we're going to be breaking down the new Mr. Beast Feastable chocolate bars. No, I'm not going to be eating these chocolate bars in front of the camera Matt Stoney style, but we're going to be taking a look and seeing if his claim about these new chocolate bars being healthier than regular chocolate bars like Hershey's is actually true. Mr. Beast's new chocolate bars are being marketed as only containing four ingredients. These are sugar cane, cocoa bean, cocoa butter, and sunflower lecithin. They're also completely plant-based and are 100% gluten-free. As a general rule of thumb, whenever you're going shopping at a grocery store for food products, the fewer ingredients listed on the back generally means the less processed that food has been. And the less processed a food product is, generally the healthier it is for you. Nevertheless, this is still chocolate that contains 170 calories, 11 grams of fat, and 14 grams of sugar per bar. So let's break this down like a delicious chocolate bar and take a closer look at each one of these four ingredients. The type of sugar used in these chocolate bars is cane sugar, which is completely unprocessed and naturally occurring sugar. There are also no artificial sweeteners used here, which is a good thing. The cocoa bean is a bean that is commonly used to make all different types of chocolate. It's related to cacao, which looks and sounds quite similar, but cacao is actually a different type of bean that is used to make most forms of dark chocolate. There are actually quite a few health benefits coming from the cacao bean, but not necessarily the cocoa bean. Cocoa butter is the light yellow vegetable fat that comes from the cocoa bean itself. This is actually one of the major ingredients in white chocolate and has a considerably high amount of vitamin E. It's famously used in a lot of different skincare products that does have a lot of healthy skin benefits, but when consumed, AKA taking a giant bite out of a delicious piece of chocolate, these skin health benefits are not actually seen. And finally, the last ingredient is the sunflower lecithin. This is another fat-like substance that comes directly from sunflower seeds. It's used in food to provide a smooth and moist texture. Yes, I did just say the word moist multiple times and is used primarily to keep ingredients from separating. It's actually quite a bit healthier than soy lecithin by the way it's extracted. This is a very common ingredient that's not only used used in food products, but also in commercial goods as well. If we compare Mr. Beast's chocolate bar directly to a Hershey's chocolate bar, it does have fewer ingredients. Hershey, as well as many other chocolate brands, also include natural flavors in order to enhance that chocolatey goodness taste. Many times these natural flavors that are placed into food products aren't actually natural at all. I have another video talking all about natural flavors and I'll put it here in the top corner as well as in the description below if you're interested. So my overall consensus about the Mr. Beast chocolate bar is that at the end of the day, it is still chocolate, which does have a lot of calories as well as a lot of sugar, for the amount of food that you're getting. A chocolate bar, unfortunately, does not replace a carrot. However, in terms of comparing this chocolate bar directly to other forms of chocolate on the market, it is actually one of the healthiest options that you can go with. I would definitely recommend these as an occasional snack to fulfill your chocolate cravings, as well as if you want to be in a Mr. Beast video, because let's be honest, that would be kind of cool. If you like this video and want to see more content like this in the future, please smash that like button as well as leave a comment down below. As always guys, thank you so much for sticking with me to the end of this video, and I will see you all on the next one.